Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. And if you are new here, welcome. So I've got an exciting video for you today. You know, if you've been watching my channel, you've seen me talk all about some of the suburbs in Memphis, Lakeland, Arlington, Oakland, that kind of thing. So we're actually gonna be exploring one of the lofts right here downtown, just to kind of give you a little bit of a feel of something different that is available here in Memphis in terms of a property that you can buy. And so I'm so excited. I've got my friend right here with me. She's also a real estate agent with Keller Williams Realty and so this is her listing her and her husband have this listing and it is absolutely gorgeous so you guys you are in for a treat in seeing this property but hey if you're new here my name is Natasha I am a real estate agent licensed in Memphis and Mississippi or Tennessee and Mississippi uh, I make videos just like this talking all about the area I help so many of you guys make the move here so if you are interested in making the move to the Memphis area number one subscribe to the channel and number two reach out to me I got my number on the screen and I look forward to hearing from you to help you make the move to the area all right Stacy take it away this unit is located downtown 505 Tennessee Street it is an iconic building called the lofts at South Bluff so if you know anything about the downtown area you know that this was one of the early trendsetters for downtown living. It's walkable to all sorts of restaurants, entertainment, the movie theater, the farmer's market, the, the list goes on and on. Because of the, the age of the building, there's just various degrees of updates and renovations, but this unit has been thoughtfully transformed from a one bedroom into a two bedroom. There are 123 units in the building. It's five floors. This one is 1,459 square feet and it has been updated with so many wonderful features. This is bedroom number two. They created this beautiful closet area, added storage at the top. They have this fold out twin bed, but it is measured out and can accommodate a queen. Now this is the primary bedroom. The queen bed does stay because the headboard is built into the wall. Storage underneath on each side in the front. And then if you were to pull the mattress back, there is like a little hatch door that you can store valuables that kind of like a safe, but without a combination. And then in the kitchen, this is probably where they've done the most work because they added a second row of cabinetry they enclosed the, the refrigerator, which does stay for the new owners. They built this custom island, which has the butcher block countertops and all these nice little features. Combined with the custom cabinetry, the added features that they have created, the two covered parking spaces, this just makes a great living space for anyone who wants to live downtown. 